we cannot establish if the aircraft was flown by any one other than the pilot. But we also cannot exclude the possibility that there's unlawful interference by a third party due to the significant lack of evidence available to the team. We are unable to determine with any certainty the reasons that the aircraft diverted from its far-flight planned route. The lack of evidence includes the information recorded on the flight data recorder, cockpit voice recorder, and other recording devices on the aircraft that could indicate why the aircraft had flown to the Southern Indian Ocean. And from our analysis and findings, we can conclude that MH370 had turned back. And we also can confirm that the turn back was not because of anomalous in the mechanical system. And we have carried out simulator sessions to determine how the aircraft turned back. And we can confirm that the turn back was made not under an autopilot, but it was made under a manual control.